Because uh, I have never seen a deceptive game like politics. And uh, if you live a honest life and want things to be done honestly, you will find it very rough mm -hmm. in politics. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, uh, I'm a son of a pastor brought up by my mother. For 21 years, I only knew my mother. She died in uh, 2014. A uh, deeply religious woman. Uh, we were taught differently. We are taught to be truthful. We are taught to say uh, what is wrong is wrong. We were taught uh, to apologize when we make a mistake. We are taught to repent when we commit a sin. Uh, but uh, in politics, there's no repentance. In politics, there's no apology. In politics, uh, there is no wrongdoing. Uh, everything you do is justified. And I think that is why I had to sit back and relook at the whole thing. Mm. My upbringing, that it, that does it really uh, uh, suit politics? Uh, because uh, you take things the way you see them, but always there are very many other cards mm. that uh, you have no idea. Uh, that they are playing and what you don't see is actually what is real what you see is never real <laughs> Amen. Yeah, that, 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 that's, that's what I've come to learn mm. I still believe that uh, we can force uh, some truth and sincerity and honesty into politics and I believe uh, darkness can't take the day uh, because I associate everything right with light, everything co uh, crooked with darkness. Uh, one day we will live in a country where uh, what people say is what they mean, where the truth will rule, where decency and honesty will rule, uh, and where people will talk, talk straight. Uh, there's a lot of uh, cutting of words in uh, politics mm -hmm. unless you are uh, very careful mm -hmm. read the body language of whoever is saying it look at his eyes and see whether it doesn't blink uh, or look aside uh, it is very hard mm -hmm. to tell when uh, a politician is uh, telling the truth or not mm -hmm. and uh, that is my biggest weakness because I say it the way it is mm -hmm. and uh, I've never had other cards I've never hide anything I say the truth but time has come uh, when I feel indecency has gone beyond, mm -hmm. uh, craftiness has gone beyond, and that we must come in and force uh, slight sanity into uh, politics again, try and force uh, some truthfulness mm -hmm. in what the politicians say. And uh, when I looked at the entire platform, of uh, what was happening in Kenya and I started writing the politicians that are playing Oka seemed to have uh, those that you can uh, maybe panel beat mm -hmm. and get truth out of them okay. uh, the rest is just uh, uh, something beyond uh, the rest are incorrigible you can correct it uh, but Oka has a team which can uh, be trusted mm -hmm. if uh, you, you push and uh, if somebody puts his uh, foot down and uh, they are coming into politics I'm not coming into politics to look for glorious seats mm -hmm. I'm coming into politics to try and force genuineness mm -hmm. we all live in this country and if anything goes wrong uh, it will affect all of us uh, you've heard me clearly say I've come here to support my brother and brother uh, asked where Tangula can we support him we can't say he's incapable yet we have never supported him let us give him this support and see how far he can go uh, I believe uh, he's one of the uh, few decent men uh, in this country uh, Kalonzi is a very decent man Gideon Moy was brought up very well he's a very decent man uh, there are people you can work with yes. and uh, they are reliable uh, the rest, uh, you really need to, to do a good job. You know, and talk of the rest, that uh, unbelieves out uh, root.